Title, A Cursed Chalice. In the forgotten corners of a desolate forest, a dilapidated cabin stood as a haunting reminder of days long gone. Locals whispered of its malevolent history, attributing its darkness to an otherworldly entity. Within this cursed abode, an ancient chalice rested on a rusted pedestal, its eerie allure drawing in curious souls. One moonless night, three friends Sarah, Mark, and Emma, ventured into the forest in search of the cabin, driven by a reckless curiosity. Armed with flashlights, they pushed through the thick undergrowth until they stumbled upon the decrepit structure. The chalice tarnished and inscribed with cryptic symbols, beckoned them with an unnatural aura. Mark, the daredevil of the group, seized it without hesitation, a decision that would seal their fates. As Mark lifted the chalice, a chilling wind swept through the cabin, extinguishing their flashlights. Panic gripped them as a guttural growl reverberated through the air. A shapeless presence manifested, its malevolence turning the very air to ice. The entity revealed itself, a creature born of nightmares, its form ever shifting and impossible to fully comprehend. Its eyes, deep voids of malevolence, fixated on the intruders. Sarah, trembling, clutched a fragment of broken glass, her only weapon against this eldritch horror. The creature spoke in whispers that seemed to crawl into their minds, unraveling their sanity. It demanded a sacrifice, a life to replace the chalice it had lost. Mark, overcome by a sinister compulsion, offered himself. The creature's shadowy tendrils enveloped him, his anguished screams fading into the abyss. With Mark's sacrifice, the chalice's malevolence grew, feeding on his life force. Emma and Sarah, driven by desperation, shattered the chalice with the shard of glass. The creature howled in agony as the cursed object shattered, its form convulsing before dissipating into nothingness. Mark was gone, but the forest silent once more. The broken chalice lay in ruin, its curse shattered along with it. Emma and Sarah emerged from the cabin, forever haunted by the horrors they had witnessed. As years passed the forest reclaimed the cabin, burying its dark secrets beneath layers of moss and ivy. Yet, the memory of that accursed night lingered, a chilling reminder that some mysteries were better left undisturbed. And so the cabin remained, a forgotten grave for a forgotten horror, waiting patiently for the next unwitting souls to awaken its malevolent power.